You know, a lot of weak and insecure men will try to humble you if you are a secure and confident woman and you love yourself. They'll say things about how you look, um, your age, and all that stuff, you know. Um, so ladies, you, you already know when you're my age, I'm 47, you don't give a fuck about none of that shit. Yes, you do. That's why you're making this video. I don't care how much you're smiling. Yes, you do. That's why you had to make this big declaration about how much you don't care and it doesn't bother you. The fact is, you're not a young, super young woman anymore. You're not going to get the same compliments. And I don't understand why some of these ladies get so upset uh, when men say something about them. But they can talk about men all day long. They can have this list of 100 things, of qualifications for men all day long. But the minute you say anything about a woman, any kind of way, especially if it's something about her looks or whatever it is, she's going to have a problem with it. Well, guess what, ladies? Stop doing it to men, and then maybe men won't do it to you. But all is fair in love and war. Like, you know right away when a man is trying to humble you. You know right away. And, um, you know, that's our cue to run. Okay. <laughs> so um, don't fall for it. Don't fall for it. Ladies, you know, if a man is trying to dog you out on how you look um, and trying to compare you to another woman, the second they try to compare you, they're trying to humble you, especially. Uh, 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 there it is. You just told on yourself again. This was, this is what it's about. This guy probably found another woman that he's more attracted to than you, and you just don't like it. But you probably compared a lot of men to a lot of men before in your life, right? Come on now. Can't take it when the shoe is on the other foot. Come on now. You got to put your big girl pants on. Especially when they want to compare you to somebody who's younger. Um, Honey... <laughs> Nice try, okay? We know those tricks. It doesn't work. Yes, it does. Because you're bothered. And you made a video about it, so I'd say it works pretty well. Don't be mad at younger women. You had your time. Remember, ladies, every day there's a new crop of girls that turn 18. So the competition is always there, and it comes by new batches every single day okay because us more mature older women we don't care to be young like that again okay we we're not insecure <laughs> okay like we were when we were younger we embrace everything and if we don't guess what we got the money okay to fix whatever we want to fix you embrace everything. Yeah, you embracing the shit out that filter that you got on TikTok. That's what you're embracing. Because the texture of your skin and the smoothness definitely does not match the rest of your hair or anything like that. So you're bothered. You're bothered. For sure. And you're jealous of other women. And this is something that all these ladies understand. Older women are also in competition with younger women. And those women are in competition with other women. All women are going to be in competition with men. So all women that are of the age to date and up are going to be in competition with each other. Women don't want to get old. They don't want to age. I'm surprised she's showing her gray hair because most women will uh, cover that up. Men, women don't want to show what they really look like. Look at her. She's covering up her neck and everything else. This is a filter. You guys can't see it, but this is a filter on this video right here. And if you notice, she put her hand in, in front of that, and you can kind of see a little bit more realistically what her skin looks like at that age. But look, just own who you are. There's going to be some men out there that want to deal with you, but usually it's not the men that you want, and that is your problem. We do. I mean, after all, when your thing stops working, y'all, y'all get the pills, right? So 
you know, don't fault us for wanting to, you know, utilize our money how we see fit. Okay. Nobody is faulting you for wanting, wanting to go get plastic surgery and lifts and fake butts and all that type of stuff. All we're saying is that when you choose to do that, understand that there's some men, a lot of men that are not going to like that. A lot of men are just going to put you in that category. And if a man has to take a pill, it doesn't mean that his thing is broken. It just means that maybe he needs a little bit of pick me up. But see, that's a completely different thing than our face, right? That's a completely different thing. Women do not like to age. That is the problem. It's all about trying to completely look young at all times. That's why all these women on this on, on TikTok use filters, bold filters, eyelash filters, smooth this filters, smooth that filters. It's because they do not want to age. They don't want to show that age. And a lot of them, especially that are, are uh, that have a lighter complexion, age a lot faster than those with darker complexions. So that's just the thing. Men, we don't care about aging. We don't get up putting 10 pounds of makeup on. We don't care if we got filters all on this and all on that. We, that doesn't matter to us. It matters to you. So you cannot compare the two. But for, for those of us that don't want to do that, we want to embrace how, you know, us aging and, you know, embrace the gray hair. Embrace it. Okay? <laughs> don't even worry about that. And, and I'm going to tell you what, ladies. The men, they love it. They love the gray hair. Don't let no man try to ever say anything about your grays. Ain't nothing wrong with gray hair. Men don't have, have care about what color hair you got. Your hair could be purple. It could be yellow. It could be pink. We see that all the time. Gray doesn't mean anything. There's a lot more than that goes into the situation uh, outside of your age. Your age has a lot of stuff attached to it. Experience, children. You being set in your ways, you wanting things your way. It's not just about your age. It's everything that encompasses that age and why you're still single or why you don't have children or why you were never being able to be in a committed relationship. There is an issue when men see women that are older like this and they're not married. They're not in a, in, in any kind of relationship or they chose to walk away from a marriage. It says a lot about women and their choices. That is the thing. You cannot be jealous of these younger women. You had your time. And I will say it a million times. You had your time. It is what it is. You cannot fault men because men are predisposed to like younger women. That doesn't mean that all men won't like a young, a older woman with gray hair or anything like that. But generally speaking, our biology says younger women. That's just who we are. Just like your bi biology as a woman says, a man that can protect and provide. It's completely the same, but it's completely different. Get with the program and stop trying to change it. Stop trying to argue with it. If a guy doesn't want to accept your gray hairs, chalk it up and say, okay, well, that's just part of the game. Let me move on. But instead, you guys get upset because that guy doesn't want you because you just want that guy. And then you create all this drama because that one guy says something about your hair. That one guy compared you to another woman. You got to be more realistic and get in where you fit in. They love it. All right. Just like us women, we, we love the gray beards. We love the grays. And men is sexy. And, and men feel the same way. Because, you know, these this gray hair, it didn't stop shit. Generally speaking, men do not feel the same way. Some men will be okay with that, and some men just won't like it. Some women will like men with gray hair, and some just won't like it. Some women will like men with hair on their head, and some like bald head men. Some men like women with short hair, and some men like women with long hair. It's all about preference. But you get butt hurt because this one guy that you just want so much and you think you deserve doesn't want you, and you got to create all of this. It's all about choice. That's all it is. Get in where you fit in. Okay. In fact, it's it's only um, highlighted more. All right. So, do you? 
And don't let no weak, insecure man ever try to humble you. Well, I don't, like I said, I don't think it's about humbling. I think it's just about being honest and it's about preference and it's about choice. I think you be, need to be a little bit more realistic and stop trying to shoot men down that don't want you. Shoot men down that don't like gray hair. Shoot men down that don't like women that have three or four children or even one child. Shoot men down that don't like dogs. You know what I'm saying? It's all about preference because as ladies, you expect men to accept all the preferences you have. All of them. Six feet, six figures, dad bod, no dad bod. You know what I'm saying? You guys have preferences too. But you don't see men walking around crying to each other saying, you know what? I'm the greatest man ever. And she should have loved my gray hair. She should have loved my muscles. She should have loved my, my pot belly. It's ridiculous. That's why you don't hear men saying it. We realize, okay, she ain't the one and we move on and we get in where we fit in. That's all for this video. Make sure to like this video, comment, subscribe to my channel. And if you're on TikTok, give me a, a follow and some love over there. I'd appreciate it. I'm definitely trying to get to at least 2000 subscribers by the end of this year. And you guys can help me do that. Much love, much respect. And as always, have a good day. Peace. May the force be with you.